Welcome back, World Basketball Manager. And we lost our first two matches, and that is unacceptable. We need a W now. We play against the Indiana Pacers now. First, uh, I would like to show you some results. Um, where can I find them? I have to figure that out. Um, sorry for that. Uh, USA League schedule. All right. The last results. Um, bum bum bum. Where? The Dallas Mavericks defeated the San Antonio Spurs 108 to 94. Have you seen the other results yet? I'm not sure how much I've shown to you. So just make it quick. I'll show you the results of September 22nd. I think you know all the other results. If you know these two, I'm sorry for that. Next time I will yeah, try to remember where I stopped. Reading the results to you. Golden State lost to San Antonio. Atlanta defeated the Bobcats. New York defeated the Nets. Okay, I think you know those. September 23rd. Washington defeated Milwaukee. Orlando lost to Miami. Mi Minnesota lost to the Celtics. Oklahoma City, a bad start into the season. They lost again against the Kings. The Raptors lose against the Sixers. Cavaliers defeat... Uh, no, Cavaliers lose to Phoenix. Houston loses to Portland. Yeah, we lost to Utah. All right, there we are. Um, big news I just read. Uh, still not getting along with those menus. Landry Fields has been signed. $300,000 per season. Two seasons. Now we play against the Pacers, their best player is supposed to be David West. <coughs> Maybe I will get rid of some players now that I have a new one, but I have to put him on the roster for the match before I start this. Landry Fields is a substitute now. And Chris Duhan um, leaves the bench. And now we hope to get a first win of the season in the third match. Indiana against the Lakers. That should be a tough one. Staples Center is sold out. Frank Vogel put on the following starting lineup. George Hill, Sam Young, Danny Granger, David West and Roy Hibbert. All right. And let's see if we are successful. Our, our first home game, but uh, as, I s as you know, the first match against the Clippers, basically, it was not an away game. It was our... On paper, it was an uh, away game, but not really. Before I begin, I try something. Can I... Makes, does it make sense to give three lead roles? I give a lead role to Kobe, Nash, and Howard. Not just to Kobe. I'm not sure if that makes sense or not. After an attempt, I tell them to play normal, offensive duration normal. Dwight Howard only inside scoring. Maybe I should tell Steve Nash to not score at all. Maybe then he will finally provide more assists. But Steve Nash is a great player, not only passing-wise, but also shooting-wise. So I guess I'll leave him on the floor. So now we begin. I press P. Let's get it on. Jump ball. Hill, I said hit the Pacers Hill, my Hill is on the bench, <laughs> got the ball, now Steve Nash with a three point attempt, nope, Dwight Howard with a rebound, uh, still zero to zero, pick and roll by the Pacers, and slam dunk by Hill, the first two points of the game, three second violation, Nash now with a three point shot, he misses it, uh, takes quite some shots now. And it's 4-0 for the Pacers. Howard with a rebound. Howard attempts a layup. Field goal. 2-4. Two to four. One foul on Metal World Peace so far. And Hill with another bucket. A foul by Roy Hibbert. And we can't get those three-pointers in. 0-4 from the three-point line. Kobe picked up a foul now. 
Pogasol also misses the three pointer. Nobody gets those in. And the layup goes in. 8 to 2 for the Pacers. Dwight Howard with another bucket. The only scorer on my team so far. But just six minutes have passed. Howard with a rebound. And he misses a two point shot. Granger to West. He jumps. Misses it. World Peace with the board. Kobe passes to World Peace. He tries a three pointer and the first three pointer goes in. 7 to 8 now. One point game. Nash picks up a second foul. I have to take him out. Steve Blake will enter. Kobe makes his first two points and we take the lead. A ah, turnover now. Kobe with a rebound. Howard with a dunk. No, he misses. Granger with a rebound. George, two point shot. Bad shot. Howard grabs the ball. Blake tries a three pointer, misses it. Put in Earl Clark for Paul Gasol and Jordan Hill for Dwight Howard. The next attempt, Hibbert with a steal. Granger drives to the basket and goes to the line, misses both. Hill grabs the rebound. Two fouls on Meta World Peace, so I bring in Landry Fields, his debut. Three point lead now, one possession game still. Clark with a foul. Two free throws go in, last minute going on. Kobe misses the shot, Fields with a rebound. Kobe, another shot, misses again. George goes to the line, the game is tied up and the Pacers take the lead. A steal by Young, a steal by Blake. And the quarter is over, 11 to 12. The result, Jody Meeks enters the game for Kobe. Steve Nash comes back in. Yeah, and Dwight Howard comes back in. <coughs> Fields passes to Howard and the third foul on Roy Hibbert. Two free throws go in. Another foul by Hibbert. Hibbert with four fouls in the second quarter at the beginning of the second quarter and they still haven't taken him out. He's in serious foul trouble now but Nash also with his third foul. So I will take him out again. Steve Blake enters. Batista has come in for Hibbert. He has five fouls. Hibbert might stay on the bench for quite some time now. Pacers regain the lead. Batista with a rebound, the former WWE champion. Fields now, a lot of fouls here. Oh, Clark with two fouls. Fields with two fouls. Paul Gasol re-enters the game. Howard misses his shot and get, grabs his first foul of the game. Six rebounds already for Dwight Howard. He passes to Blake, two-point shot, misses it. A lot of rebounds for Howard. Fields misses a three-pointer. Another rebound by Howard. Batista with a steal. Batista inside shot misses it. Landry Fields, second rebound. Pogasol. We can't get the ball in. Not a high scoring game here. So I bring back in Kobe, who also has just two points. World Peace re enters the game. Four point lead for the Pacers. Granger makes one of two free throws. Kobe. To Howard and the ball goes in. Three point game, 18 to 15 for the Pacers. Pacers have the lead. Now a five point game. Kobe misses his shot. Batista goes to the line, makes one of two free throws. They miss quite some free throws, the Pacers. Three point play by Paul Gasol. No single person on the floor has scored in double digits so far, but if you look at the score, you shouldn't be surprised. George makes two free throws. Kobe goes to the line, makes both four points on his account. Dwight Howard, nine rebounds. I smell another double-double for him. One point game, Hansbro goes to the line, makes both. Fields and World Peace both with three, uh, three fouls. And Howard now three fouls, so I bring in Jordan Hill. Also Antoine Jameson enters the game. Six point lead for the Pacers. Kobe passes to Pogasol, tries a three pointer. We are just one of ten from the three point line. Hansborough misses, but gets his own rebound and scores. Eight point lead. Kobe drives, misses. Kobe not playing his best game so far, but maybe he will improve in the second half. 
Eight point game last minute of the first half. Well, piece is blocked by Danny Granger, Batista now on to David West. Blake blocks the shot, Augustine regains it. 20 seconds to go, Hill with the rebound. Kobe drives to the basket, and misses again. Just And it's halftime, 24 to 32, eight point lead for the Pacers. Not a single person has scored in double digits. Kobe Bryant, four points just. Well, nothing is decided yet. I bring back in my starters. Best player for the Lakers so far, Dwight Howard, 8 points, 9 rebounds. And we go on. World Peace to Nash. Nash passes to World Peace and he goes to the line, misses one, makes one. Batista grabs a foul. Nash, 3 point shot and it goes in. 4 point lead for the Pacers. But they score again. Howard with a potential 3 point play and he makes it. 11 points for Dwight Howard, first person to score in double digits, 5 point lead. Now World Peace misses a 3 pointer, West with a rebound. Batista, a steal by Dwight Howard and, and he scores. Dwight Howard playing in Superman mode now. Kobe, 3 point shot and he makes it 2 point game. 1 possession game and rep Frank Vogel takes a timeout. I will not change anything. I haven't taken a single timeout in the first half. Hasn't been the timeout. That's that's the factor where realism is maybe not as high that you barely take any uh, the timeouts. Whether yeah, I can influence it myself, but the computer didn't take one either. But it's still a quite a realistic game, I think. Oh, except Co except of Kobe, all my starters have picked up three fouls now. I'm bringing Jameson for Paul Gasol. Kobe with a second foul. Landry, Landry Fields comes back in. Two point game. Dwight, Dwight can tie it up now. Granger with a rebound. David West inside shot. About a half of the third quarter has passed. Kobe, two point shot. He misses it. Just two of ten for Kobe. But now he makes one. Kobe might become hot in an instant. But the others. Keep scoring, it's just a two-point game. It's a lot more scoring now, I get the impression. Dwight Howard scores 19 points. Fourth foul for Steve Nash, so I bring in Steve Blake and I uh, turn down the, pay, uh, the speed now, make it fast sp uh, speed. And the game is tied, 48-48. I think I turn down those animations. Uh, we will see when I switch to normal speed, which I might do. And we take the lead, three-point lead, 51-48. to 48. Meeks enters the game for Kobe. Maybe not the best point of point in time to do that, but I want Kobe rested for the fourth quarter and Joni Meeks has proven to be capable as well. Batista with a block, one point lead for the Lakers, who we want our first victory now. George drives to the basket. Lane attempt and it goes in the Pacers regain the lead. Might be trading, changing leads now. And now the Lakers have the lead. Steve Blake with two points, his first three second violation by David West. The Lakers hurry up, lay up attempt, and it goes in. Steve Blake. 90 seconds to go in the third quarter. West with the ball, attempts the lane, misses it. Jordan Hill enters the game, the next opportunity. Batista, foul by Howard. Howard has four fouls, and he has left the floor. One minute to go, Landry Fields passes to Jameson, three-point attempt, ah, he misses it. That could have been a big one, George with the board, goes to the line now, makes one, and makes the second one-point lead for the Lakers, 45 seconds to go in the third quarter. Hill attempts a three-point, I shouldn't, I have to tell him, Mr. Hill, you just take inside shots. Elbowing foul by Hill, Batista goes to the line and the Pacers have the lead again. Fields attempts a jump shot but too late, one point lead for the Pacers. This is gonna be a close one. I try Paul Gasol as center now. Nash re-enters and Kobe. Nash and Howard might become might go get into foul trouble. 
Roy Hibbert hasn't entered the game in quite some time. Maybe he will come back now in the fourth quarter. Augustin passes to the high post. George receives the ball. Jump shot for two. Makes it. Three point lead. The Lakers foul by George. Hibbert is back in the game. Maybe he will foul out soon. Uh, layup. Mr. Hibbert with a rebound. They move into the front court. Give and go play and a foul by George. The Lakers can tie it up here. Nash with a two point shot. Makes it. One point lead for the Pacers. About 11 minutes to go. Pushing foul by Landry Fields who has four fouls as well now. Meta World Peace will re-enter. Lakers have the ball now. Kobe takes it. Attempts a three pointer and he goes to the line for three. Makes the first, misses the second, and makes the third. Which we have the lead, one point lead for the Lakers. Kobe now has 14 points. He has picked up his game in the second half. Ah, now we are tr changing leads again. And Roy Hibbert has fouled out. One point lead for the Pacers. Kobe drives to the basket. Layup attempt. Slam dunk. Boom shaka laka. Nine minutes to go. West with a th three point shot. Gasol blocks it. Jameson. Pick and roll. Kobe passes into the pivot area. But Young with a steal. Kobe with his third foul. Paul Gasol goes back to power forward and Dwight Howard re enters the game. Pacers have the lead again. Nash goes to the line for two. Misses the first. Makes the second, and we are all tied up at 62 points. Three-point attempt, and Young hits it. Howard, layup attempt, passes to the field corner. West with the steal, bad turnover, bad turnover, bad timing. Augustine, no, Lakers regain possession of the ball. But Young with the steal, pass to Augustine, Augustine, DJ Augustine, two-point shot, makes it five-point lead for the Pacers. <sighs> Don't let them run away again. Okay, they haven't run away uh, yet, but... <laughs> Stay in contact, scoring-wise. West runs coast to coast. To Paul George, he decides to drive. But he travels. Great for us. Six and a half minutes to go. Kobe with the inside shot, but he gets fouled. Goes to the line. Makes th misses the first. Miss misses both. Kobe misses both free throws. What's up with him? Six minutes to go in this match. Layen is missed. Pogasol with the rebound. Give and go play. Nash gets the ball. Tries for three. Misses it. West with the rebound. Indiana. Passing around. West. Inside shot attempt. Nope. Pushing foul by Paul Gasol who has four fouls as well. And and Tuan Jameson enters the game for him. West inside shot. Misses it. World peace with the rebound. Five minutes to go. Foul by Nash, who has five fouls now. But I will keep him in. C I will keep him in the game. If he fouls out, he fouls out. Steal by Antoine Jameson. Great. Now we need some scoring. Kobe drives to the basket. He now he passes to the three-point line. Butler, Raz Razul Butler, with the steal. <sighs> Can't afford those turnovers now. And slam dunk by Ansbro and seven-point lead for the Pacers. I turn the speed down now to normal speed. Ball goes in five-point game. Four minutes to go, approximately. Given gold player Butler decides to drive. Layup attempt. No good. Rebound by Granger. Jump ball now. Hill gets the rebound. Pacers. Three and a half minutes to go. Five point lead. Two possession game. Hans Bro attempts a layup. And makes it. Seven point game. Screenplay for the Lakers. Nash gets the ball. Passes to the pivot area. World Peace attempts a lay in and gets it in. Five point game. Less than three minutes to go. Indiana moves into the front court. Passing game by Indiana Pacers. Ball goes to Batista. Two point shot. Howard with a block, big block. And he has the ball now in his hands. Lakers in possession. 
ball is passed around. Jameson gets the ball. Attempts a layup. And gets fouled. Goes to the line. He has to make both now. Makes the first. And makes the second. One possession game. More than two minutes to go. Ball is passed around by Indiana. Hansbro with the ball in his hands. Attempts a layup. Misses it. Get the rebound now, guys. Now Pandograph grabs the rebound. Attempts a shot. And makes it five point game. Less than two minutes to play. Passing game by the Lakers. Go Kobe with the ball in his hands now. Attempts a jump shot. He has to make it. And he does. Back to a one possession game. About 90 seconds to play. We don't want the third loss. Razul Butler drives to the basket. And gets fouled by Dwight Howard, who has five fouls as well now. But Re Butler goes to the line, makes the first free throw. And makes the second. About one minute to go. Kobe drives to the basket. And, and charging foul on Kobe Bryant. I don't believe this. Hansbro inside shot. And he makes it slam dunk. 19 seconds to go. Offensive duration now short. And immediate foul, yes, but this might be too late. 20 seconds to go. Batista with a rebound. Gets fouled by World Peace. Goes to the line for two. I think this looks like yet another loss for the Lakers. Batista makes both. Nine point game, 20 seconds to go. I don't have much hope that we will win this one. Pick and roll play. Howard. I told them to hurry up scoring wise. Howard misses it and that's it. Ladies and gentlemen, the Lakers lose their third game. West with a rebound. Ball is passed around, five seconds. And Kobe picks up his foul number five. Hansbro will make this a double digit lead. Makes one, misses the second. Jameson with another foul. Come on guys, this game is over. 11 point lead West makes one makes misses the second a lot of free throws have been missed in this game world peace gets the ball tries a three pointer the game is over 70 to 81 Pacers win Rye Hubert has fouled out Three, four players have scored in double digits for the Pacers. Paul George, Hansborough, West and Batista. The best Laker has been Dwight Howard, 21 points and 9 rebounds. No double-double. Kobe with 18 points, but he missed quite some shots. Five assists, seven turnovers for Kobe. Steve Nash again, more turnovers than assists. Yeah. And I'm getting frustrated. I press P to exit. Hello. Yeah. This part is over and in the next part we will see who our opponent will be and how we will get along. Take care. See ya.